Hey guys, it's Transformers Kid 2. I know I haven't done a video in forever, and I have not done a collection video in forever. Um, but, you know, it's the weekend, and I have some time, so I thought I'd do a little co collection video. Um, in case you guys haven't noticed, um, check out my Walmart Revenge of the Fallen display. There are ads on that video. Please, please click them. So I can get more ads on more videos. Uh, Google had contacted me, and then they accepted my AdSense application, and I applied for partnership and have yet to get a response. So anyway, collection video for January of 2010. Um, we'll start as we always do with the movie shelf. Now my movie shelf. My 2007 movie shelf was much bigger. I have, like, only the main characters and figures that I like out in the premium series. Um, the rest of my movie collection is in my closet right there. Uh, check out previous videos, I don't know, last year. Before Re Revenge of the Fallen came out, uh, and check, check those out. So, uh, we're gonna look at Revenge of the Fallen. These are all deluxes, and there's, uh, Superion in there. As you can see, I finally got Long Haul. I got it from ToysRS.com, but I also ordered Bludgeon. And here's the box. So I ordered Bludgeon and Long Haul. And I got Long Haul. But they also sent me a Fallen. I already have a Fallen. It's right there. Um, and it says right... Well, you can't see it, but I ordered Bludgeon. And they sent me a Fallen figure. I'm like... Fuck. So I contacted them and I'm going to send it back. Um, so yes, I finally got Long Haul and I still have yet to see him in person. I saw him once at Disney World um, for $40 at the Epcot Center in Japan. I'm like, I'm not paying $40 for it. Um, Human Alliance. This is from Mike Rimfire. Uh, Prime. Devastator. The Fallen. It's Jetfire up there. Megatron. I got Scalpel. Um, and there's more figures behind it. Got Demolisher, finally. And Mixmaster, finally. I don't like it. I do like Demolisher, though. Um, got the Voyager Megatron. And Stratosphere. I will be reviewing the Constructicons this weekend, hopefully. And there's Scalpel and Skywarp. Um, I still have yet to open Skywarp, and I don't plan on opening Skywarp. Um, but I haven't gotten anything new in a while except for, um, it's Megazord. I always wanted the original. This is the next best thing. It's, eh. Yeah. Got, uh, Convoy here. Galaxy. So this is the, the American release. Um... Same stuff as is over here. I just transform the Millennium Falcon and move stuff around. Um, I'm hoping to find uh, Masterpiece Skywarp for 30 20 bucks, like um, TJ Omega did. And Captain America stuff. And over here, have the Shadow Commander device label Sound Blaster. And in here. I left these in the cardboard braces, but it's, um, and you can't, you wouldn't be able to see it anyway. It's my alternative figures. Um, I had Skywarp on pre-order until I realized, oh, he's coming out in May. That, uh, I got credit towards birthday of last year, um, and I ordered, um, whatchamacallit, I ordered, uh, Legends Devastator. And it wasn't going to come until November, and before then, you know, the G1 version is announced, I'm like, fine, I'll wait until March. And I was like, you know what? And then they announced this alternative Starscream, and I got the other alternatives, and I actually like the line quite a bit. So then I'm like, ah, fine, I'll order Skywarp. And then it's like May, and Starscream comes in March, and then we get announcements, they're coming in May, and I'm like, screw this! I'm getting something at retail, and then I order at Toys R Us, and they send me one of the wrong things. Ugh. Anyway, here's Universe and Animated. Um, they got Jetfire and Jetstorm back there. I put them there so I can 
make my alternatives. Um, I want to get uh, electrostatic sound wave. Not so much freeway jazz. I was never really excited about that figure, but it's kind of growing on me. I did see it at the uh, Epcot Japan and Disney World, but it was twenty dollars each, and I was like, God, they doubled all the prices here. Um, uh, Star Scream and Iron Man. At my window figures here: Samurai Prowl, Universe Prowl, Universe Dinobot. Uh, animated Swindle and Animated Wasp in here. I have duplicates of each of these figures and a duplicate of this. I have each of these figures sealed, including this one, except for Prowl. I really like Prowl. Um, and over here on Iron Man, we got Titanium Man, Prototype Iron Man with the armor on, Satellite Armor Iron Man, Prototype Iron Man with the armor off, and Iron Monger opening cockpit version. Alright, um, things have been going pretty good, you know, I'm pretty excited that Google had contacted me and stuff. Um, hoping to do some more reviews, I think this weekend's gonna be Constructicon weekend, I already reviewed Rampage, but I have Long Haul to review, I have, um, Demolisher and Mixmaster review, I have A Fallen there, and A Fallen here. And I can't wait to get Bludgeon. I might be getting my allowance soon, and I'll probably get Dirge. I really want Dirge. I'm um, going to review this guy. I was very happy. It's like reliving my brother's childhood. Um, I didn't grow up with the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, but they were on, and I really liked the show. I grew up with, like, Turbo and Wild Force and Galaxy and Space and Lightspeed Rescue and Ninja Storm. That's where I stopped. Ninja Storm just ruined it for me. Um... So, yeah, guys, uh, my collection, there will be some reviews coming, um, check out my Walmart display, um, please, please click the ads, I really need the help, guys, um, hey, and if I start making good good money I'll I'll give it back to the fans with a contest so all you have to do is click those ads on that's 946 January 23rd um if you see anything you want me to review I mean there's check out my older collection video to see my full uh 2007 movie collection cuz this is nothing this is nothing out of my 2007 movie collection it's the biggest collection or line in my collection, and I have no more space in my closet now. Oh, I love that pack. But anyway, um, so yeah, guys, please click the ads. If you see anything you want me to review that I have yet to review, please check my channel first and see if I have reviewed it. I hate people that say, can you review blah, blah, blah. Oh, I already reviewed that. So I'm just not going to respond to that person. It makes me look like a douche, but, you know, that's your fault for not looking. Oh, Japanese animated figures. They look great. I can't guarantee I'm going to get any. Uh, I might get one, probably Prime, but we'll see. Maybe even Blitzwing. Um, unopened figures. Unopened Nemesis Prime. I have an unopened Starscream, an unopened Dinobot. Unopened... Waspinator and Samurai Prowl on open swindles behind there. Um, see, uh, yeah, I got a substantial amount of unopened figures. I have like 12 or so. I haven't counted in a while. I didn't mention all of them. But yeah, guys, um, go check out that, uh, video and please, please, please click the ads. Um, I, uh, need the help. So anyway... Transformers Kid 2 saying thank you all for watching. Uh, there will be more reviews coming. Um, I'm going to get some more money soon. I'm kind of low. Uh, I didn't do well in school this quarter and I kind of want to focus more on grades. Um, I, uh, so yeah. See you guys later. Transformers Kid 2 rolling out.